That's how Lizzo ended her speech as she accepted the Grammy for Record of the Year. I showed you that moment right away because I didn't want you to be thinking, oh, it's about damn time you showed that moment. So there it is. Now, we'll get back to Beyonce. But yeah, clearly her soul wasn't broken that she lost to Lizzo. But Lizzo's excitement started with pure shock. The Grammy goes to Lizzo for about damn time. Fellow loser in the category Adele showed it was easy on her to lose to Lizzo. She was dancing away to Lizzo's now Grammy winning hit. Me and Adele having a good time, just enjoying ourselves, just rooting for our friends. So this is an amazing night. Taylor Swift was dancing too as Lizzo took the stage. Taylor was not nominated in that category this year, but she knows all too well about being shocked by an award win. Harry Styles was a nominee in the category, but he had a big smile on his face for his Coachella surprise guest. Um, huh? Once she composed herself, Lizzo had the superstars captivated as she reassured the doubters that staying positive will bring positivity to your life. I promise you, you will find people, you will attract people in your life who believe in you and support you. But then she had to bow down. Beyonce, whoo! If you cry, I'm gonna cry. In the fifth grade, I skipped school to see you perform. <laughs> My sister, she got me out of school. It was literature, I'm good. And I guess at this point, Lizzo can't actually see where Beyonce is in the audience. And um, where are you at, Beyonce? My eyes are wet. <laughs> so just like the beginning of the show, Beyonce's in the room, people. Are you? Lizzo is searching for Beyonce. You changed my life. You, you sang that gospel medley. I'm assuming that Lizzo is referring to the medley that Beyonce performed as part of Destiny's Child in the early 2000s a few times. Ah. And the way you made me feel, I was like, I want to make people feel this way with my music. You'll notice that this part of Lizzo's speech, Jay-Z decides he's going to stand up. I guess he's like, oh, I better stand up because Lizzo's really keeping it under the misses. <laughs> so thank you so much. You clearly are the artist of our lives. I love you. After the show, Lizzo posed with Beyonce and Adele for some photos. And B and Liz exchanged some words as well. Congrats to Lizzo, that was an incredible category, especially with 10 nominees now. It's just like, the list is insane. I don't think Beyonce should have won that award for Break My Soul for Record of the Year. Nah, no, Lizzo was a great win. Harry could have won, yeah, for sure. But no, Lizzo was a great win.